Hello, how are you doing today? Well, I'm here to keep on uh, having conversations with you about different subjects. Now I want to address the fact that I mentioned uh, other things like occultism and metaphysics. And I wanted to just state the differences between one and the other. Um, like, for example, in occultism, the main goal is not only uh, knowledge. And they call the main goal, it would be power. Um, but when you have knowledge, you do have power. Um, the thing is, the main goal in occultism is uh, knowledge. And it's that uh, knowledge that we receive from the universe. And it's something that it's, um, how can I say it? Um, it's something that we, that we get. We are constantly being answered by the universe. Not in words, but we get the answer. Um, so if you, you know, if you want to know, that's part of it. In spirituality, it's more focused on a communication with the spirit worlds, uh, significantly through mediums who are able to communicate with the dead. Um, this practice has emerged from the 19th century and it's very popular. But again, anybody that wants or says that it's psychic medium or has any ability to receive information from the senses, they had to develop it. That's not something that you're born, actually, let me correct myself. You are born with the ability to develop these senses, to be able to get this information from the universe. That said, it, that means that everybody can develop to be knowledgeable. It takes time, it takes studies, and it takes a lot of information and a lot of practice. If you don't practice meditation and other exercises, you don't develop. But everyone, every single person, we are all born with psychic abilities, knowing or not. It's just a matter of the knowledge to recognize them and to develop ourselves to understand the abilities that we are gifted. Let's say it that way. Metaphysics is more a philosophy, and it's also the same end goal. It, they are interlaced. It's like the what, what I want to do here is teach you energy work, which is a, a broad term. Um, and it refer, refers to any practice that works with the body's energy to heal itself, to heal yourself or others. Um, so um, I don't know, I'll leave it here and think about it. Everybody has the gift, everybody has the ability. You don't have the knowledge or you have not developed it, but everybody's at different stages in that development and everybody um, develops differently. So are you willing to learn? I'm willing to teach. I was uh, reading a little bit on, uh, on the book of Enoch from 1962, it's the edition that I have, and I wanted to add from the introduction, page 11, it says, but all these things according to ap apocalyptics were divine secrets hidden from the beginning of the world, but revealed to God-fearing men to whom was accorded the faculty of peering into the hidden things of God and of understanding them. Upon these men was laid the privilege and duty of revealing the divine secrets to others, hence their names, apocalyptics. Um, 
and again let me show you it's a uh, book of Enoch from 1962 and so I feel the same duty of showing you you see 1962 I think it's backwards but but there you got it um I feel the duty and I feel the need to share what I've learned because I I see the world fearing education and fearing knowledge and at least in the United States and that's concerning because through knowledge knowledge is power it's the only power that we truly have and the, the only power that we truly take with us all the riches in the world will stay upon earth but the knowledge will be buried with us